order the mystery box, you pretty much tell them the size and then they'll send you, I believe, it What's going on everybody? I'm Jeff Robe and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, how you doing? Today, I got one pair of sneakers and also our boy has hooked it up with some more clothes that I picked up from him. I really do have just about everything over there, all the major brands. So if you're looking for some clothing for the spring and summer that's upon us, that's where to go. Um, if you wanna head over to my Instagram, I post stuff over there and I can directly tag people, which I can't do here on YouTube anymore. But if you miss all of the old Jeffro videos, you can subscribe to my Patreon for only $5 a month for the price of a coffee. It helps me out tremendously and all the money I make from that goes back into making this channel what it is, helping you guys save money on all the latest clothes and sneakers, because that's my goal get you looking the way that you want for a fraction of the cost but with all that out of the way let's go ahead and hop on into it i did think that this was something else which is why i have already shedded the fedex wrapper off of it but let's go ahead and keep it going or maybe i can just slide her out here oh there we go so we got a jordan four box kind of has a all cream tone to it haven't really seen this color yet pretty cool there take the top off take the top off the new steam pots and joes check them. and it looks like we got the lucky green four so if you've been watching the channel i did just do the lucky green threes and now we're rocking with the nike sb4 and this thing is super sick as you can see it does say nike sb on the back there doesn't have your typical jordan logo and that's because this probably has a nike sb insole and it does so if you don't know nike sb does stand for skateboard and just throughout the years nike has always been affiliated with skateboarding but not necessarily jordan but as time has progressed from people like terry kennedy back in the day that skated baker they just kind of brought a little bit more of an inner city aspect to the skateboarding world and before you knew it people were skating ones they were skating fours and now we're actually seeing our first jordan 4 nike sb collab so that is super sick i skateboarded for a long time um that's probably where my overall sense of style and fashion originated from um, apart from music videos as well but skate videos you're always looking at what your favorite skater is wearing they also have their own personalized shoes like nba players or major sports players so skateboarding has always been just kind of a really high um, styled aspect action sport and it's super sick can't really go wrong with skateboarding i highly recommend if you have um children five six seven get them a skateboard send them off in the neighborhood man that's where i made all my social skills was just hanging out with my bud skateboarding around the neighborhood but super cool to see this this does have this little suede toe right here so if you are going to skate these uh i mean expect the normal wear like you would this kind of just it's just your typical suede reminds me of an america shoe pretty much on the toe has the rubber we got some accents of brown, which I think go really, really good with the green on this thing as well. Got the green shoelace catch, green tongue, green pull tab, and then of course that Nike SB Air sole in here. Yeah, super cool. Let's see if I can't show it to you. Maybe bust the tongue up. It says SB on it. There we go. So, very cool, good way to start the video. I love Jordan 4s. They have them in every colorway you could think of. So if you've been hesitant, you don't own a pair of 4s yet, get you a pair of 4s. They're comfy, they go with everything. I got some there, I got some there. I got them all over my room. I wear them pretty religiously. Um, they look good with some long pants. Not gonna go wrong with the Jordan 4, but let's keep it on moving. If you don't feel like you got the best look at those in this video, make sure you head over to my Instagram, follow me over there. Save yourself some money. 
But let's get into the meat and potatoes of this. So this is actually going to be from TB. I do have more clothes coming from Danny, so if you're waiting on that video, don't worry. But TB is also a company that I have worked with um, going on probably three years now. Very trustworthy business. They message you quickly. They have multiple accounts on Instagram, so if you want to uh, check them out, you can. Um, I will also post some of this over on my Instagram that way making it nice and easy for you But let's start pulling this out and seeing I see chrome hearts. So I'm already happy <laughs> Cool, and this is their mystery box So if you order the mystery box you pretty much tell them the size and then they'll send you I believe it looks like I have three items in here I'm not sure if there's different levels of mystery boxes. If there is, I'll look into it, but I think there is just the one, and I think it's around 150 bucks or so. If you noticed, it didn't come in a box. It came in one of those packages. Uh, so shipping will be actually pretty cheap, and um, it'll get here pretty quick. So let's uh, bust this bad boy open and see what we got here. So off the rip, it looks like a hoodie, and this is a rude hoodie. It's got a big middle finger right on the middle. Isn't that nice? <laughs> so it kind of looks like a junior high desk. It's just got a bunch of little scribbles and scrobbles going along over there. Got a big hood. It says rude across the, the top right here. We got a little S right here on the hood. Looks like a Slytherin or a <laughs> Harry Potter-esque emblem on the hood right there. So pretty cool. Lewis Tower. There's a little motocross guy. So pretty much all types of different stuff going on. Um, that middle finger is definitely bold though, just right there. <laughs> all right, let's keep her on moving. It is a mystery box, so you're not sure what you're gonna get like I said, you tell them the size, they send you the stuff. This is an XL, looks like a Chrome Hearts white t-shirt. Let's bust her open. And everything is gonna come in these bags too. That way, if the packaging does get a little bit compromised, they're gonna be sealed away in these plastic bags, so you're not gonna have to worry. Oh, the back of this is sick. So that's the front, and then on the back it says Chrome Hearts Made in Hollywood, California. It's white, got the gold writing. Um, also features the little CH down here at the bottom, and at the very base of the back you get the little Chrome Hearts scroll right here. Can't go wrong with some Chrome Hearts. Sterling silver and leather goods, absolutely fire pumped to have this. I actually don't think I have a white chrome heart shirt, so yeah, cool. Thank you. Let's go. Keep it moving. And this last piece looks like it might be some Eric Emanuel shorts, maybe? Yeah, that's exactly what these are. And with these, if you um, wear, you're going to want to two times size up on these, because if not, they're going to be pretty much as long as your underwear are. So these are a 3XL. So shirts are XL, two size up on the shorts. Um, as you see, they're just like a mesh basketball short, nothing too fancy going on besides the graphics, but it's got the little basketball goal. You've got the basketball itself up there at the top and then the EE on the right side. So yeah, super sick video. Sneaks over here going to town on the bubble wrap. That's her favorite part of filming days. But yeah, if you want some clothes, make sure you check out TBRU. I will post some stuff over there on Instagram, making it nice and easy for you to find them. Uh, if you want some of these SB4s, those will be posted over there as well. Uh, got those from a very reputable seller that I recommend you check out. So yeah, I'm Jeff Rowe. Thanks for tuning in today, and I'll see you guys next time when I got some more stuff for you. Hey, how you doing?